It's not like we can just throw this in the garbage can. I understand that, but you're taking resources away from the city of Fond du Lac every oh, I... single time you guys do this. Okay, we but found... the bomb squad has a lot of things that they gotta do. I understand. This is like the grenade that we pulled up. Just got around the bend. Look at this old railroad bridge. This was one of the very first bridges ever built in the state of Wisconsin. We just got underneath the railroad bridge. If you look right there, Danny and them just found an abandoned boat. It's all full of water and everything. If you look right there, it's actually got the registration numbers on here. We might actually be able to call the police and uh, see who this boat belongs to. They probably lost it. Probably had a big storm and it drifted away. It's definitely a nice boat. It's holding water, so you know it's definitely good. This thing looks pretty nice, man. I might uh, just take this with me and... Uh, might see if the police let us have it. All right, the gin shows found something cool. Look at this. Found like an old blade to a knife. All right, Clay's just found this old shovel. Look at this thing. This thing's been down there for a while. This thing's pretty rusted. What the heck? Here you go, Clay. What'd you find over here? A no parking on this side of the street sign. Hey, that is really cool, man. Clayton's got something heavy. What the <laughs> heck? It's a snowmobile ski. No way. Uh, I wonder if that was a snowmobile. Look at the snowmobile ski that Clayton just found. That's sweet. Dude, that thing had to be heavy. I don't know what this is. Oh, this is gonna flip my kayak over, y'all. What is this? No way! What is this thing? What is this? That cart. That's for the back of a train to loosen it. No freaking way, guys. I have no clue what this thing is. Definitely let me know down in the comments if you guys know what this thing is. This is awesome. It's like a wheel of some sorts. All right, Clay's just figured out what this thing is. What is this, Clay? So this is actually what they would put on the back of a train car to open the locks. That makes sense. Yeah, that's awesome. That is awesome. Any train lovers would love to have Dude, this thing, I bet. That awesome is so fine, cool, bro. man. Thank awesome you. Fine. All right, Jen's just found this other half to the snowmobile ski. We done found two of them already. All right, Danny, what'd you find over that's there? Old that's an old Zippo. Zippo. Check that out. Wow. All right, cool. All right, I just hooked on something heavy. Oh, my kayak. It's coming up. Man, this is huge. What? Look what I found. Like a... Is this a wheel? This is like an old train wheel. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. I don't think that's a gear. That thing was heavy. That is awesome. Clay, what did you just find over here? This looks like... Oh, this is a Chevrolet steering wheel column. Chevy this, steering column. This is sweet. <laughs> All right, Jen just found one of the best things so far today. What is that? Switch lever. That is cool. That's an old switch lever. Probably to the railroad bridge right here. That is awesome, Jen. All right. Got some good weight coming up. Don't be a railroad plate. Don't be a railroad plate. Oh, check it out. Found a pickaxe. Look at this. Nice, man. Heck yeah! Found a pickaxe, man. Look, What'd you find? a pickaxe. Pick yeah, how sweet is that? Dude, that is awesome. <laughs> Paige, right, what'd you box. just find over here? I guess it's a landmine. You found a landmine? Yeah. Take mine. Yeah, let's see. All right, let's take a look at this. Oh yeah, it's definitely one of these another landmines. Wow. All right, we're gonna be really careful. Let's set that in there. Mine was empty. It's a cool find, man. Thank you. And he's just found like a, I'm not going to hold that. He just found like another top to another landmine right here, guys. This is crazy. To them to put the bucket? Yeah, we're going to be really careful not to touch this. There you go. All right, Jen's just found another landmine. Look at that. That's number three. That's something again. What is this? Check this out. I thought it was a hatchet. I'm not for sure what it is. Got something coming up. What? It's another spring. Look at this thing. Look at all the clams on it, too. I want to think I might have something. Going a little white. Yeah, I definitely have something on here, y'all. Oh, this is heavy. What the heck is this? Oh, we got a couple, a couple of railroad spikes. Also found this weird looking piece of metal. Look at this. Anybody knows what something like this goes to? Let me know down in the comments. All right, add it to our pile. Uh, I think I felt a click. Let's just take a look at it. Whoa, three more railroad spikes. All right, we're pulling up some more stuff. What is this thing right here? Like some type of pipe of some sorts. Felt another click. It isn't really heavy. Oh, what is this? This is like one of them property marker stakes. That's what that thing looks like. All right, if you guys have been wondering what I've been doing with all my scrap metal today, we actually took that abandoned boat that we found over there. We're gonna load up all the scrap metal and put it inside that boat today. All right, Danny's loading the last of the stuff in the boat. Look at how much stuff this is. This is incredible. This thing is loaded. 
Holy cow, we found all this today. This is at least three, 400 pounds. All right, we got everything loaded up. Got all the metal in the back of the boat. We're all heading back to the shore. All right, man, how do you feel about your brand new boat that you got today, man? Pretty good. I think you found another possible explosive in there. All right there. Why? So what makes you think that these are landmines? Uh, looking them up and the fact that we've done this magnificent before and we've seen them before. Okay. So we figured we'd give you guys a call and take a look. This is the one that had us most concerned is this big one right here. Okay, but you took it out of the water and you put it in? Yes. Yeah. It we found them. It didn't go off. Right, which is a good thing. We're actually with magnet fishing. If you pull something out like this, obviously with it drying out and causing them to explode, so right away we put them in water and mm -hmm. came back over here. So yeah. we've only had them Not too So long other than it being a similar shape, because I mean it's obviously very deteriorated. Yeah. How can you say for sure that this is land? You can't. That's why you gotta have that's... bomb squad from the almost like Okay, but found... the bomb squad has a lot of things that they gotta do. I understand. This is like the grenade that we pulled up. Yeah, we found. 20 mortars I in Michigan and they had to come out and they took them all and detonated them with C4 even though know, they were unactive they still have to dispose of them the right way. Okay. It's not like we can just throw this in the garbage can. I understand that but you're taking resources away from the city of Fond du Lac every I, single time you guys do this. I understand that. Okay. Oh what a crabby one. She's crabby. Yeah, so we just found a potential explosives and the police never are not had, happy with us. Never had city worker get mad for us finding no, something dude, like... this way. Page? Yeah, it's what my fault. What happened? Uh, well, you kind of spoke it into existence because you said, look out for these. If it's filled in the middle, it's a landmine. So luckily you told me, but it's my fault. I'm the one that pulled it up, so. And now they want us to dispose of them. But they say yeah. it's inconclusive. So I guess we'll find out. <laughs> 